Um, I have been asked by a lot of people over the past couple of weeks a little bit more about what I do. And I've been talking a lot about it and getting a lot of questions and having a lot of really good conversations. And so I thought I would hop onto Facebook and um, tell you all, because I feel like not everybody knows what I'm doing. So I feel like I, I just want to tell you all and share why I love it. And more importantly, hopefully um, clear up some misconceptions. So I am a national marketing director at the Juice Plus company. And the company itself has a couple of different business models tied into how it works. And one of those business models is network marketing. And it's a model that I've really grown to love. I didn't know really anything about network marketing when I started this business. I just loved the products. And um, I'm going to really just love this, this business model. So I wanted to, um, to first explain what that is and then clear up a couple of misconceptions that, that I, I tend to see. So first is about the model. Network marketing is a business model and it's meant to put the power of sharing and educating about products and services into the hands of the people that are most passionate about those products and services. So for example, I, I know way more about my products than the dude at GNC knows about any of the products in his store. I can totally guarantee that that's true. <laughs> um, so, so one of the questions I, you know, I hear is, is there's some network marketing companies that maybe don't have great products. So are there network marketing companies that don't have great products? Probably, just like there are products on the market that are not great. Things get recalled off of shelves. Um, a whole bunch of supplements got pulled off of shelves a couple years ago because what was in the product on the um, on the label was not in the product. That happens in any business. It's not network marketing. It's the company. It's the integrity of the company. It's the quality of the company's products. It's their commitment to excellence. So I would say that that's a product problem, not a mar network marketing problem. Okay. So the second thing that I hear is um, is that sometimes people are pushy and they feel like either they're being harassed by their friends or they don't wanna be pushy and harass people. So if you feel like, again, I would argue that that's a people problem, not a network marketing problem, right? So my first piece of advice as a true New Yorker, if you feel like you're being pushy and nagging people, stop doing that. <laughs> stop being, no one likes to be pushy and no one likes to be nagged. So don't be that person. And, and I would argue, you know, if you're starting this business or you're in this business, take the time that it requires to get educated and be good at this profession, just like you would do at any other profession. Um, and so again, I would say that that's a, that's a, that's a people problem, not an industry problem. I see my job as educating people about the power of whole food nutrition. I want people to know there's an easier way to get fruits and vegetables into their diet. I love that my paycheck reflects helping people get healthy. And I wanna share both of those opportunities with people. So I feel like I'm in the business of educating and sharing, and I love that. So if you feel like you're in, you know, in conflict, talk to your teammates, uh, let me know down below. I've got tons of resources that I can give you that would help you get over that stumbling block. The third is people ask me if this is a pyramid. So pyramid schemes are illegal. And so no, I'm not doing a pyramid. <laughs> that would be my first uh, full stop answer. Secondly, you might be asking about kind of models where the person at the top makes the most money. And I would argue that this model is true of traditional businesses, not network marketing businesses. So for example, I went to the Apple store a couple weeks ago, had this great guy help me with um, my daughter's phone, because you know, I've got kids and their phones are always breaking. And, um, and he was amazing. So you know, he's a genius at the Genius Bar. Is he ever going to become the CEO of Apple? Probably not, uh, because that job is already taken. But 
I have a teammate on my team who's a 24 year yoga instructor, 24 years old. She just made it to the same position in the company that I'm at, national marketing director. She did it in record time. She gave herself her promotions. She doesn't have to wait for anybody to give her permission and the world is her oyster. So that's what I love about my business. Everyone in my business has an opportunity to create opportunities for themselves and opportunities for other people. I find it some of the most rewarding work I've ever done. I am um, fulfilled and challenged every day and I just love it. I love the people I've met, the friends I've made, um, the community that I'm in. So um, if you're listening to this, I hope it's helpful. I see some of my friends on here on Facebook Live. I love you all so much. And um, yeah, have a great day. Mwah.